are you among those interested in knowing how much a DNA test costs in Nigeria? Well, you are not alone. Many people have been hungry for this information. And today, I'm not only going to tell you the amount it takes to run a DNA test in Nigeria, but to also tell you the different types of DNA tests and the best place you can get it done seamlessly. With the current happenings, I don't need to inform you that the need for DNA tests has increased drastically and it has brought about uncertainties, validations, and to some homes it has shattered and some it has strengthened bonds. DNA stands for diazeribonucleic acid, which is a molecule that carries genetic information or makeup. So DNA test is used to analyze and determine these genetic informations. Every individual has a gene, and in this gene, you can find everything about that particular person. That is why DNA test is a powerful tool to humanity. Now that you've understood what DNA test is, let's take a look at some of the types of DNA tests. But it's important to understand that the different types of DNA test, okay, the names come from the purpose of the test. For instance, forensic test or forensic DNA test. This type of DNA test is used in forensic science to analyze DNA samples from crime scene, all right, in order to identify suspects and victims. That is why it's advised you don't touch anything in crime scene. Another type of DNA test I would want you to know is the pharmacogenomic test. From the word pharmaco, you would know that this test deals with drugs. Okay, it is used in the pharmaceutical industry to you know, analyze the DNA sample okay, and predict how one would respond to a particular drug. This would in turn reduce the side effect and enhance the effectiveness of that drug. You can remember when we spoke about the production process of CASGV, which is a drug used in the treatment of sickle cell disease. Genetic screening test is another type of DNA test that provides insights into your risk of developing specific diseases or to examine career status of health conditions like lactose intolerance and sickle cell anemia. The different kinds of DNA tests might take us hours to discuss, but let's talk about this particular one that has been making waves lately which is the paternity test. Before I proceed, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you are watching on Facebook or TikTok, please follow. And since you have done that, thanks for being part of this success story. Now, back to business. The almighty maternity and paternity test are used to determine a child uh, biological parents. This type of test would compare the child's DNA sample with that of the alleged parent to confirm or deny paternity or maternity relationship. Maternity DNA test is used to determine if a woman is the biological mother of a child. You know, years back, there is this crime that was prevalent, all right, when babies were being swapped. I don't know if such thing is still in existence, okay? So with DNA tests, you can determine, okay, this baby is really your child. For paternity DNA test, the cardinal focus is to determine if a man is the biological father of a child. 
And this type of DNA test can be used for immigration purposes in case you intend to travel and maybe one of your requirements is to show that there is a biological relationship with the people you intend traveling with okay uh this type of test might be needed although some embassies do have different approved centers they use for such tests so it's then your duty to you know check with your embassy what they need and you know the way to go there is another paternity dna test you have not heard of which is the avuncular dna test here an aunt or an uncle is used to determine paternity when the father is not available for testing i know you might be wondering where you can get your dna test done well never worry we have partnered with top centers to make sure you get your dna test done seamlessly so kindly send us a dm let's get started from there for those wondering the time it takes for dna test results to come out it takes about eight to ten working days and in some cases it might take lesser time since you have waited to this very point let's talk about the cost of dna tests in nigeria well before then kindly subscribe to our youtube channel follow us on all our social media platforms if you have not done so for how much a dna test costs in nigeria it is dependent on various factors like the test center is accreditation and reputation and most importantly the type of dna test you intend to carry out the cost of paternity tests between a father and a child in nigeria cost an average of 250,000 naira to 300,000 naira and for additional child it might come or incur an additional cost of 150,000 naira for immigration dna test the cost is about 400,000 naira depending on the number of persons to be tested okay because additional cost might be incurred other dna tests have varying cost depending on your individual needs now that you know what dna test is and you understand the cost in nigeria please do well to share with your loved ones and also if you have any question comment below for those that have subscribed to our youtube channel we say a big thank you and as usual see you in the next one